Welcome to today's podcast. I'm excited to dive into an interesting topic that revolves around key mapping in the popular text editor Vim using a plugin called Blink.cmp. If you're a Vim user, or even just a fan of coding, you'll find some of the features and functionalities we discuss here particularly intriguing. So let's start with the basics of key mapping in Vim.cmp. Each user can customize their experience by assigning specific commands to keys, which really enhances efficiency when coding. Just to give you a quick example, imagine you're working on a project and having to switch contexts frequently. Wouldn't it be nice if you could just hit a couple of keys instead of fumbling around with the mouse? That's where key mapping comes in. Now, one cool thing about Blink.cmp is its ability to merge custom key mappings with preset options. This means if you're comfortable with a default setup, you can still tweak it to better fit your workflow. For instance, you might define how pressing certain keys like the arrow keys should behave when navigating through completion items. It's like tuning your car's engine for better performance, tailoring it to your specific needs. Speaking of customization, let's talk about snippets. Snippets are these handy shortcuts that expand into longer chunks of code. For example, typing a simple keyword could instantly turn into a multi-line function, and Blink.cmp works really well with them. You can have the editor insert snippets when you press a specific key, which saves a ton of time. But you need to make sure you have the right key mapping set up so that it all flows smoothly. Here's something to ponder. How often do you find yourself typing out the same code over and over again? Have you ever wished you could minimize that repetitive strain? This is where you might begin to see the allure of using snippets and key mappings together. By creating a workflow that minimizes repetitive tasks, you can redirect your focus to problem solving rather than clicking around or typing out the same thing endlessly. And don't worry if you're relatively new to Vim, Blink.cmp includes friendly snippets support, making it easier for beginners to get started without feeling overwhelmed. It's like having training wheels while learning to ride a bike. You can remove them when you're ready to take off on your own. As we wrap up today's discussion, I want to leave you with this thought. Imagine your coding environment perfectly matching how you like to work. What would that look like? Would it involve less clicking and more typing? How could you set up your own key maps to help streamline your tasks? This journey of customizing your coding experience can be just as engaging as the projects you work on. Thanks for tuning in today. Don't forget to think about how you can incorporate these tips into your workflow to enhance your productivity. After all, a well-configured editor can be a game changer in your development process. Until next time, happy coding.